With the theme Life on Land and Climate Action, the inaugural Karimui Show will promote conservation, agriculture and culture of Karimui people. The show will be from the 21st to the 23rd of November. Of the 22 activities, the highlights of the show will be the Mr. and Miss Karimui and the cane walking performance by specialized locals. And we have a big feel for the show to be lost and it's going to be fenced. We are working on the fencing of the field. We'll be having toilets, we'll be having grandstand, and we'll be having night activities as well. So we are expecting more than, well, people will be very excited to attend it. And we are hosting 22 activities during the day. So. A logistical challenge lies ahead as traveling by air is the only reliable access into Karimui. Partners with Melanations have already secured deals with charter companies for eight charter flights from Goroka to Karumui for the show. They are calling on business houses for support, especially for logistics, which is the huge part of the expense. Uh, the losses part of it, it's going to be very tough. We have to have charters. Karumui is only accessed by plane, so. And then. We have to get someone from to cover the show to attend the show. They might fly out from Boroka to Karamui. We don't have a sponsor yet at the moment, but we have input the response from feedback from potential supporters in which. Karamui Nomane is a district of the Chibu province. It has a huge potential in agriculture with crops such as rice and cocoa grown in the area. Culture, on the other hand, is one that the people of Karimui have forgotten. The culture there is mixed. We have people from the Gulf, people from Eastern Islands, people from Jiwaka, uh, people from Southern Islands, all living there. And culturally, they've lost some of the important uh, ways of doing things. And so this show is very important. We want to revive them to think about their cultures and tradition, ways of dancing. The organizing committee, partners with Mellon Nations, have so far received funding from its internal donors. The expected cost of the show stands at 200,000 kina. Interests have emerged from Digicel and Commerce, Trade and Industry Minister Vera Mori for support. The Karimui show will be a learning experience for PWM, who are planning to host a similar show in Managalas in Northern Province next year. Charlene Airy, National MTV News.